Emily DJ yawe. Can I DJ most DJ? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sibo and tonight very exciting evening ladies and gentlemen as you can see there's a glow <laughs> Duh. i have my <laughs> my light on eh, eh, eh. anyway 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 <laughs> darian is in the house <laughs> anyway so i made a friend yesterday i made a friend and this friend that i made is a dj and she's playing a set tonight at a club in brixton <laughs> so i got guest list <laughs> I'm excited. She asked me like, where are you from? I'm like South Africa. She's like, yeah, you look South African. Apparently, we have a look. Uh, we have a look. We have a look. <laughs> we have a look. If you look South African, you you can tell. So she's like, do you listen to a piano? Not I'm a piano. Love it. Love it for her. Uh, a piano. Uh, I was like, yes, duh. It's like my soul, my bread and butter is a piano. But yeah, so I'm gonna be doing my makeup now. So as you can see, my hair is not done. We're gonna be bringing out the girly today. The girly. Who's the girly? The wig. I haven't named her yet. So maybe you guys can. So maybe you guys can help me name her um, down below in the comments. So like, tell me like what you think. Cause like, I wanna get to the point where I have like several wigs and like the several wigs have different names. So like at every time. So you'll see her, and then when you see her, we'll see what the persona she gives off is, and then from that you can name her. Okay, okay, cool. So now I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm gonna switch it over, and then we're gonna come back for the transition. All right, you ready? Ha! <laughs> Team. Okay, so what do we think? Do we like her? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What are we naming her? Because I'm struggling to find a name for what I can call this, like, feel persona. Let me show you the fit. Mm. Ah, so she's showing a leg as fuck. I feel like you officially make the list of the most exciting person I've met. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm happy. Guys, yes. I'm behind the stage. The Emily DJ, yawe. The Emily DJ, most staging. The most staging, the DJ. I can show her. I'm like... Hi, Matt. Absolutely.
post club meal. Holly. <laughs> Happy Heritage Day! <laughs> so this is the fit. Patricia made this, obviously. Who else makes my clothes? Um, where's Tyler? Listen, listen, it's cold, but I'm like, nah, I'm wearing my heritage. I don't care if it's cold or if it's snowing. If it was snowing, I probably wouldn't. But I'll just throw on a jacket and I'm just gonna go for my hair appointment now. So <laughs> yeah. I'm so tired. I don't understand. Who thought it was a good idea for me to be up outside catching the first train in to my area? What? Guys, but it was so much fun. Zero regrets. Zero, zero regrets. I had so much fun. Like, so listen. When I say so much fun, I basically mean the most fun I've had, like, in a club since I've been here. So, like, the other time I went to, like, a club was, when did I go? It was, like, that banana cabaret thing that turned into a club. It was fine. It was fun. It got uncomfortable at some point. But, guys, yesterday, and, like, the DJs that were there, I met so many cool people. So, listen... What a time, guys. What a fucking time. Be black. Um, yeah, no. Being black is awesome and amazing. <laughs> so when the club closed at 4 a.m., we walked and we got Morley's. What Morley's is, is like a chicken franchise. And it only, the chain of the chicken <laughs> only exists in the south. Yeah, the south of London. So you can only get this, like, chicken franchise in the south so we had to well they were like you have to get it there's no like you're not gonna get more leaves anywhere else so get it now and i tell you now i tell you now this rib bone was so tasty and then the chicken let me tell you something about this chicken oh my god it was so good so i had it as my breakfast before i went to my hair appointment because i was too tired to eat when i got in at half past six in the morning <laughs> so i decided to rather have it as my power for the day ahead this what what is this got here it's my hair appointment and like i confirmed with this lady and jiggy jiggy she says she didn't write it down and i'm like how did you not write it down when i spoke to you yesterday to confirm whether you want cash cash in hand after doing the hair like you didn't write it down does that not seem like i'm coming me asking about payment does it not say mm, she's definitely coming so now, she didn't let me in, but I'm still gonna go. The price, the, the big 50 pound price, doesn't include the hair. So now I must go to the hair shop to buy hair. And that's an additional, so like this hair is gonna end up costing me more. Got me one skin to single and be a box braid a bit. Now I'm cutting it. Cutting my hair, so I went to go buy the hair now, which means that the total of my hair today is costing a lot more than I budgeted for. I'm just so upset, and I don't even know if this is the right hair that I got. Show me a picture, they didn't have a picture, so I just got like this. Like, do you know what? 
Oh. Now this confirms why I don't want to get my hair down this side. Look, what, what nonsense is this? What is this? Anyway, so I'm back and I'm showing Darian my hair. Um, you guys are not going to be able to see it yet. I want you to see Darian's reaction first and then I'm building up anticipation, okay? Okay, wait. You ready? Oh, my word, I love it. A black girl line her braids. Absolutely yeah. gorgeous. The colour. Right? The colour. Everyone was like, the colour looks good. The colour looks love, good. I love the colour. That is so pretty. Oh, my soul. And they like, like coils it at the bottom. That is so cool. <laughs> that is so awesome. I love it. So it's clear to see that Darian loves the braids. So I'm so excited. I remember like, oh, I'm going to cut it. And every time I see what I look like with braids, I'm like, oh, it looks so great. But then we all know that my hair is not the healthiest. But <laughs> are you ready? Come close, come close, come close, come close. like doing my hair and stuff like that she like ended up apologizing and being like um she made the mistake not like putting my name down her head was all over and she's like she's she's evidently put pressure on herself because then she booked people on like more people but like she apologized and we ended up vibing she's really cool did my hair really well and like kept saying that my hair is weak and brittle so when she was saying that i was really concerned i'm like i'm probably gonna cut my hair and like after this my hairline is probably gonna be evaporated anyway so probably gonna cut it or not depending how i feel when it comes and then i'll probably start being a proper wig gal if you have good wig recommendations drop them down in the comments below because your girl has this much experience with wigs the one that i got well, have we decided what we're naming her firstly secondly i got a fringe because i didn't want a hairline mess because i was like what if i don't install properly because installing is expensive we've got to be glued hair dryer metal comb hey 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 it looks like a lot so i wasn't emotionally ready but i really did want a wig so that's why i got whatever we decide to name her um but just someone suggested Betty Boop. I do feel like she gives Betty Boop like kind of vibe. But yeah, by someone I mean Uyanda. Hi Uyays. Sunday morning, rain is falling. Every time I sing Maroon 5, I'm like, Whoa. Whoa. am I surprised that he cheated? I mean, it's part and parcel of being a celebrity, but yeah, we don't know. Anyway, it's Sunday morning and I'm going to the gym. <laughs> Where am I? I changed the girl. I'm going to the gym and then, um, because I'm okay, let me tell you how I got to go to the gym. So I'm reading this book called Atomic Habits and it talks about like bundling up something, like putting in a habit before you do something that you normally do anyway. So I normally go out. Ugh normally go out on sundays to go do my groceries so i'm like okay while i'm out i might as well go to the gym right so i'm like before i go do my grocery shopping i will go to the gym right and then when i work i'm like okay cool i'm gonna book a class so now i have to show up otherwise it like counts against me you are about that ah guys if this is autumn what the does winter feel like anyway 
um, no, because I booked the class, I'm like, okay, now I booked the class, I have to go. Got out of bed and I put my gym clothes on, I'm like, okay, now I'm putting my gym on, I have to go. So I put, I put myself in a situation where I have to go, but not have to go, I get to go. That's another thing that you have to, like, that the book is teaching, because you get to go. You don't have to, you get to, right? Oh, anyway, I'm on my way to the gym. After the gym, I'm going to do some grocery shopping and topping up of, like, essentials, and yeah, it's a steady Sunday. One thing about me, I will definitely be doing that class again. Oh, felt so good. It was legs, bums, and tums. So just focusing on those three main areas, and we all know your girl needs it. Because I'm trying to grow my booty. <laughs> but now I'm gonna go do some shopping at a leisurely pace because my legs be hurting. I'm gonna make sure that I'm gonna stretch to that. Otherwise, I'm not gonna be walking well tomorrow. <laughs> I told y'all to not let me outside the house to take away my bank card and y'all didn't. Now I'm here about to buy shoes. How cute. 
to these little and look at the price. How cute these little babies look. And like to be fair, <laughs> this is me convincing myself. I was looking for a pair of these ones because I've been seeing like people and they look so cute, so cute with them. And then there's these. And they two different sizes. They're two different sizes. And because they're two different sizes, they're like ridiculously reduced. And with this ridiculous reduction, I can just wear double socks. that's the weekend done like that oh my god feel so short but like i did so much this weekend and i regret nothing <laughs> regret nothing um so i'm going to what i'm gonna do now i think i want to take a nap but i won't take a nap because i'm not but like, taking a nap is just gonna set me back in what i actually have to do but yeah that's it for the vlog guys okay guys <laughs> Sorry, okay. One, two, three. Okay, guys! If you did like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Um, what do you want to comment down below? Oh, yes! Comment down below what we're naming the wig. The wig gal. And also, um, the restructuring and the like new feel like new type of like channel is coming soon so stay tuned in for that subscribe put the notification bell okay guys thanks bye ya.